Hello, I'm Alan Gray, Editor-in-Chief of Newsblaze.com. I was talking today to Judith Piazza, who's the editor of the Student Operated Press, and she asked me if I'd make up a little tutorial to teach her young editors and writers about selecting text, copying, pasting, dragging and dropping. So that's what this is about. So I'm here on the front page of Newsblaze.com and I'm going to grab some text from here and I'm going to copy and paste it up into this search box up here. And so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to set the start point right down here next to this B. I'm going to click down on the left mouse button and then now I'm going to keep that click down and I'm moving the mouse until I've got all of the text that I want and now I'm going to let go and it's selected all of that text and now there are several things I can do I can do a drag and drop I could uh, copy that into my clipboard so that's what I'll do first I'm going to copy this into my clipboard I could either right click and bring up this menu and hit copy I could use the keyboard control C that copies to the clipboard or I have an MX400 5 button mouse and I click one of the buttons and that copies it into the clipboard. Another thing I could do is I could just drag it up here and the way that you do that is you click down, left click down, hold that down and then you move the cursor to wherever you want it to go and then let go and there it is. So that was the drag and drop. Uh, it's still in my clipboard so I could also paste it in there. Let me show you something else you can do. If I come down here and I select Bruce's name and I copy that into my clipboard and I get this piece of text here and I drag and drop that up in there, I can come to the end and that text, Bruce's name, is still in my clipboard so I can paste that in there. Now the way that I pasted that in there, I could either right click and use the menu and paste or I could use the keyboard, control V, that's a paste. And then the other thing is I have this five button mouse and one of those buttons does a paste. Here's something that you might not know about when you're selecting text. Let's say I start this and I only get uh, half of this word and I, I let go and I really wanted the rest of that word. I can hold down the shift key now and click wherever I want in here and it extends that uh, text. If I click further back here it reduces it but it keeps the start, it knows where it started off from. So that's one thing that a lot of people don't know. When you're doing copying and pasting sometimes you want to do that between windows and you can, you can certainly do that. The thing that you don't want to do ever is use Internet Explorer like I'm using here and have the other browser open uh, Firefox and select and drag and drop between the two of them because it, you lock both the browsers up. You can do it from Internet Explorer to Internet Explorer or Firefox to Firefox, it's fine. Don't, don't uh, mix the browsers up. Here's the, here is the mouse that I use it has the standard left and right clicks it has a scroll button in the middle then it has a couple of keystroke as assignments it's got two buttons on the side I use this one for copy I've programmed this one to do paste then the scroll button you can push that to the left or to the right to the left I make it do enter to the right I make it do delete it's a great little tool I recommend it if you're doing any amount of copying and pasting So that's the little tutorial today. So come and see us at newsblaze.com and go and see Judith and all her young writers at the Student Operator Press or go over to the Hollywood Sentinel and see all the great things that uh, Bruce talks about over there. Hope you come back soon.